In this video, you'll learn how to configure the approval workflow in a document library. You'll find the workflow button under the library tab, and clicking that button will take you to the workflow page where you can start making a new workflow. You can choose from the multiple built-in workflows that are present. The approval workflow is the one that we'll choose here, and give this approval workflow a unique name. The task list is where all the tasks for the workflow will reside. History list is where the history for the workflow will go. And I'm going to choose to start this workflow automatically when a new document is created in the library. You can set the approvers right now at design time or later when you're actually running this workflow or somebody else is running the workflow. The request field right here is a message that's going to be in the actual task that's going to get produced for the workflow. You can set this right now, or once again, you can set this later as well. And other fields like due date, duration, and more can be filled out either right now or later at runtime, which is what I'll do. I'll set it up later. The workflow is now saved at the library and ready to be run.